In the multi-million dollar global satellite launch market, Indian Space Research Organization has made itself more competitive and this time it is about heavy satellite launching rockets. On the 5th of June 2017, ISRO achieved another milestone as it successfully launched its most powerful rocket, GSLV Mark III. It is important to know that a PSLV can launch around 1,000 kg satellite, a GSLV can launch around 2,000 kg, and now with this GSLV Mark III, the weight limit has gone up to 4,000 kg, and with some modular changes, this limit can be increased to even 6,000 kg. Through this rocket, ISRO sent a heavy satellite of more than 3 tons, which is called GS-8019. It is a communication satellite, which is the first satellite of India that is capable of providing internet services using a space-based platform. The reason why this is so important is because earlier, for launching a similar satellite, ISRO had to spend around 120 million US dollars as it had to rely on European Space Agency and now it can do the same launch in its own country by spending only around 45 million US dollars. Not just that. ISRO can now offer its heavy satellite launching services to other countries too, which means more earnings. Well, that sounds really great, but there is something more. For the first time, ISRO has powered the GSAT-19 satellite with lithium-ion batteries, which are indigenously made. Now, we all know that India has to import oil to meet its energy needs and the successful run of these batteries means that ISRO can share its expertise in lithium-ion batteries for a domestic commercial use, which means India can further develop its own technology to run battery-powered electric vehicles in the future. That can be a real game-changer for India. Another point is that this launch has opened the way for ISRO to finally send humans in space, as this rocket is capable of carrying humans too. Thanks to ISRO, the price to send heavy satellites in space is going to come down a lot. And it means that so many countries around the world can now dream to have their own affordable and powerful communication satellites in space, which can positively impact the modern lifestyle of millions of people around the world. For ISRO, it is a journey to make itself self-reliant in its rocket launching capabilities while improving the quality of life of the people of India as it continues its exploration in the vast space that still remains largely unexplored from the point of view of modern science. That is why it gives a tremendous opportunity to all space agencies of the world to have a mutual cooperation and also to independently discover something new even though some of them may have a smaller budget or different capabilities. For ISRO, it is not just about success or failure and it is also not about restrictions or boundaries. For ISRO, it is about good intentions hard work and consistency and that is why it seems that there are no limits to what they can achieve. See you again.